guys welcome back to my channel it's me again here with another video for you guys today's video is going to be a DIY eyelash extensions so if you're interested in seeing how I put on my individual eyelashes then keep on watching okay guys so this is everything you're gonna need you're gonna need your tweezers I use these curved ones right here also you're going to need a spoolie can't really see it. A, a spoolie. You're gonna need your glue. This is the glue right here. Okay. This is the one I use. You're gonna need something to put it on. So I'm gonna just use this plastic top thing. These are the eyelashes I will be using. And a mirror. Hello. <laughs> so you're gonna need a mirror. So that's really everything that you're going to need. And yeah. So the first thing that you're going to need to do is make sure you have a clean face, especially around the eye area. You don't want oils or any kind of gook or any kind of makeup on your eyes because it will not be helpful for when you're trying to put the glue on your eyelashes. Oil, glue, doesn't match. So I am going to set up my area. I am going to be using the eyelashes. So I have them out of the box. Obviously I have them out of the box. Yeah, so I'm going to take my glue, shake it, put the glue right on this lid right here. A little bit goes a long way. So I'm just going to put like a drop. Okay, two drops. Okay, two drops. I'm going to put two drops of glue. And this most likely will be enough for the whole process, both eyes. This is the eyelash glue that I use right here I will link it down below for you guys um it is for sensitive eyes I mean it still will burn if you get it in your eye but it's a sensitive so I figure that's a little better for since I am not a professional oh yeah disclaimer I am not a professional at all so do this at your own risk um yeah so don't do it if you're not comfortable with um inventing with your eyes <laughs> So yeah, so now I'm just going to take a hair off one of these eyelashes. I start with the long eyelashes first and then work my way in. So I start with the outer corner and work my way in. So I'm gonna just take the hair. So I'm gonna take it like this. I know it's upside down for you guys, but I think you could get it. So let's try it. Well, no, I can't do it that way. So I'm going to just take a hair like this and you want to kind of hold it like not too i want to just hold it like this you probably can't see but you don't want to grab it to um there's like a little glue on this one but you don't want to grab it too high up and too low you want to just grab it kind of in the middle just for you to have enough resistance i guess to be able to place it on your eyelash so yeah and another thing is that these eyelashes I only use eyelashes that do not have the knot so it is not free not free which are to me the best and kind of seamless and I always get compliments that it looks so nice and so realistic so yeah that is it now for placing it on my eye when I first looked on YouTube to see how to do it I attempted to do it the way everyone else was doing it and I tried to attempt to like place it on top I'm just not good at that so I decided to try a different way and place it on the bottom which to me it looks more natural when you place it on the bottom anyway and like I said a lot of people compliment me about my eyelashes and they said I can't even tell look down and there's nothing on top that's gonna look like I have them because they're all on the bottom so yeah so I'm just going to dip let's move my finger so i'm just gonna dip just a little glue and i want the glue since i'm doing it here on the bottom i want you can't really see it too well but i want the glue to be more on the inside of the eyelash since i'm going to be on the bottom whereas if you were doing it on top you would want it to be on the bottom of the lash for it to stick on so i kind of gonna hold it like this let me make sure you can see so wait wait okay hold on <laughs> 
sorry bear with me so I'm gonna hold it like this and I want the glue to go right down here so yeah this is the way I'm gonna do it finger come on finger so yeah it's not really focused I don't think but I'm gonna have a little dip I like to kind of drag a little glue off a little goes a long way then I am going to look for my eyelash and kind of just place it on my eyelash you don't want to blink <laughs> but anyway you don't want to place it on your um skin because you it probably it, it will burn a little bit not really burn but you'll feel a little sting and i hold it up and i'm just going to use this to blow it because i don't want it to get into my eye at all because it will it will stink so I kind of want it to dry first so I'm just going to take another one right about halfway there's like a little glue just pull that off okay and then I'm going to do it again and then again I'm just gonna place that next to it and then push down so. I think I'm in the clear so yeah so I'm gonna just keep on adding on and with practice it will get easier and easier to do and with these because I usually do the individual individual ones and that's just way more time consuming and these are actually not that bad and they don't look bad so yeah and also, I don't, if you could see, I kind of leave a little bit of space in between just because I feel like that gives a more natural look. And I'm a pretty natural girl, kind of natural girl. So I like a natural look. So just gonna get repetitive. So now I'm just going to comb them out. That way I can see which ones are loose, which ones aren't and how they look I'm not feeling this one okay got it off without taking a hair so if you get it early enough you could take it off without ripping your eyelashes off so now i'm going to do the other side because i think i'm good with this length right there So I'm gonna do the rest of this um, size off camera and then I will come back when I am doing the next size. So I'm done with the long length and now I'm going to move on to the medium length. And it is just the same exact process over and over and over no matter what length it is. So I'm going to probably do the medium of two here I probably only put about two short ones. And then I'm going to now do the short. Meanwhile, I'm still using the same glue and it spilled on my table. Well, the tablecloth. Okay, sorry if the angle changed, but my camera died. So, I didn't put anything on, so it died right on time. So, I'm up to the short. And I'm going to put these on the same way I've been putting everything on. I think I should put more of the mediums in here. Not that you could answer me right at this moment. But anyway, yeah, whatever. See, I think you guys are here with me, like a family. And I don't know if you noticed, I don't think I said it, but I kind of like to 
put a little glue on the eyelash itself. So now I'm just gonna look at myself. Bear with me for a moment. Okay, so I am going to try to put one more if my eyelashes could take it because it's also about how much weight your eyelashes could take and these are very thin little hairs so we will see and i still have glue it's very tacky but it works just as good so i picked a thin eyelash for this eye just because i feel like this eye looks a little more full anyway And that's all folks. So this is my complete eyelash extensions look. Do I look good? Can you tell? I really like them. So I would say this whole process took me about 40 minutes to do, which if you get them professionally done, it probably takes about that long 45 an hour to do it anyway so you know and it's so much cheaper because i bought these for 4.99 a pack and they had a 10 percent sale so whatever that was i think it showed up it showed up it came up to like 2.99 maybe it was more than 10 percent whatever but anyway yeah so this is my final eyelash extensions look right here as you saw I did it from the bottom so you can see all of that on the bottom but when you look from like regular view like this can you even tell really you guys have probably been able to tell because you've seen how I did it but even from here can you tell I wish I could see what you guys are seeing right now but I can't because my eyes are closed but yeah this is the finished look my bra strap just wants to keep peeking out. Thank you guys very much for watching this video. If you enjoyed this tutorial, then give this video a like. Also, if you have not done so already, please consider subscribing to my channel where I will be doing all kind of videos. Like always. <laughs> if you want to see me and my journey on trying to get into beauty, type thing like I said I am not a professional I do not even know how to do makeup that great but I am trying to learn so if you want to see me learn how to do makeup and my journey I am going to be filming some videos of me just attempting to do what other people do at least what I think other people do so I will see you in the next video again thank you very much for watching have a nice day night time yeah bye guys Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, did I say subscribe? Yeah, so, subscribe to my channel, please.